finally. <laughs> what? What's going on, guys? Nice desk. Thanks. Is it new? Yeah. It's great, isn't it? Yes, indeed. This sure is a real nice desk. <laughs> You know, it's weird, because I already, I, I kind of miss my old one, you know? <laughs> so now he wants his own desk. <laughs> Why don't you talk to Dave? I'm sure you can have both. <laughs> hey, Matthew. What? Come on, come on with me. What did the transit commissioner say? Well, it's impossible to get anything done over the phone, so I'm going to go down to his office and state our case in person. Excuse me, how long has Matthew been lobbying for a new desk? Well, there's no lobbying. He just happened to mention it over dinner one night. David, they, uh, they don't really need to know about our dinner. <laughs> so, dinner and a desk. <laughs> What's next? You're going to get him a pony? <laughs> Talking about Bill. Come on, Matthew. Let's go. Oh, hold on, Dave. Before you go, you better take this. Right. Go on. Hello. Yes, it is. Huh? Who is this? Uh, that's my pal Tony Palmer at Desk Emporium. <laughs> Tony? What's Tony? No, 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 Tony. I'm, I'm not in the mood to bargain. Hey, Dave. There's a man calling from that derailed train. He's on a cellular phone and he sounds real. Tell him the whole. You gotta go, Tony. Hello. Oh, yes, yes, this is Dave Nelson. I'm the news director here. Now, uh, sir, are you really on the train? Great. No, 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 I didn't mean that. No, of course it's not great, no. But, uh, sir, I'd like to put you on the air if that's all right with you. All right? Okay, take this up to Lisa in the bus, please. Now, sir, I'm just gonna have to put you on hold, and then I'll, I'll patch you through, and you'll be on the air. Okay, thank you, sir. Dave, honey, I've been to Desk Emporium, and their stuff is crap. I'll bear that in mind, Catherine. You do that. A new development on that stalled number nine train in Chelsea. Mr. Frank Silveri, a passenger on that train, has called WNYX on his cellular phone. Mr. Silveri, what is the mood on the train? Yeah, this is Tony Palmer at Desk Emporium. You in the mood to bargain? Back in... Hello, Mr. Silveri. Mr. Silveri. Mr. Silveri, Mr. Silveri. Great. We lost him. Conference table, everybody, now. Matthew, you. let the Whoa. elevator go, Matthew. <laughs> you just never know which one of us is going to come by. You know, so <laughs> slow. Okay. Listen. Everyone seems sort of distracted today by something, so let's just take a few minutes to get it out so we can focus on the work at hand. Who wants to go first, Bill? Well, actually, I do have a thing or two on my mind, but I'd much prefer to discuss them over dinner some night. <laughs> Unless Matthew has you all booked up. Bill, if you'd like to have dinner sometime, that would be my pleasure. Actually, I'm very busy this month. Hey, uh, Dave? Yes, Beth? Yeah, let me just give you the lowdown if I could. I think what's happening is, is that everybody's getting really upset because you and Matthew have become best friends so fast. Ah, okay. See, now we're getting somewhere. You see, I knew this couldn't be all about desks. Yes, it is. <laughs> Now, I am sorry if you've all gotten the impression that I, I like Matthew more than the rest of you. That is simply not so. Well, you don't have to make it sound so implausible. <laughs> all right, they pulled the train about 50 feet, but then it stalled Lisa, again. Lisa, not now. Now, I know I've only been here a couple of weeks and you don't really know me that well, but I'm sure as you get to know me, you realize I'm a very fair and just person. All right. Why don't you guys continue to discuss the desk, and I'll sit in here and single-handedly broadcast the news. It's a deal. <laughs> Lisa, it's not really about desks. Yes, it is. <laughs> there seems to be some confusion about the fact that I had dinner with Matthew. So what? What's the big deal? Dave and I have had dinner before. Really? Well, yeah. Once. Or twice, maybe. Two dinners? This is unbelievable! <laughs> Beth, is uh, Sergeant What's-His-Name still on line four for me? Nope. I'll take it in here. No desk, no dinner. Land of opportunity, my ass. 